everyone this is Jasmine and welcome back to my youtube channel and if you're new thank you so much for being here thank you so much for watching this video clicking on this video i hope that this video can provide value and i hope that you can relate to this video because i want to put content out there that is relatable that it's real that people can learn from and grow from and just let people know that they're not alone if you don't know me i've been making youtube videos for like the past 10 years ever since i was in high school and i've done it like just sporadically and just randomly because i love talking to the camera i like sharing my thoughts i like being the star of my own show but i've never like hit it off and like have had major growth on youtube um, but I love this as a hobby and content creation is something that I am passionate about. So if it turns into like a part-time career, a real career, then great. But if it doesn't, then I just hope to put out content that ha does contain information that is valuable for people, even if it doesn't lead to like me making money and everything because that's why I love YouTube. I love YouTube to hear other people's stories, to relate to people. My content in the past was basically mostly beauty and fashion, try on hauls, clothing hauls, and reviews and demos and stuff like that. I just never found success in that route. And you know, I have I have some skills. I have makeup skills. I know that the quality is not that good right now because my ring light is um, broken. So I have to like, <laughs> have it just sitting down somewhere is not behind the camera which is like the best part the best thing to do with the ring light but i have skills i have you know really good makeup skills but it just i just haven't found like crazy success in it obviously there are way better makeup artists than me and that are super super passionate about it live breathe die makeup spend their whole paychecks on makeup and i've spent a lot of money on paycheck on makeup but people like go crazily intense with it but i'm just not like that i just love makeup and i love doing it and i love teaching myself and i've put out content doing that um and then with fashion and beauty and fashion and try on cl uh, clothing hauls i've done that as well and i've some of my videos have done really well with uh fashion content and try-ons especially my fashion nova videos but i don't think it's sustainable for me because you have to spend a lot of money to always try to keep up with everything that these fast fashion companies are putting out and it's just not something that i want to be a part of consistently i want to invest in good clothing i don't i don't want to like hoard too many things so that's why i feel like makeup and clothing even though i do love being girly and playing dress up and buying all those things i don't want to be so like i don't want to hoard all those things I eventually do want to be minimal and just you know have the basics and yeah some fun things here and there and some cool things but that's what I've realized about myself so I don't really think I am the person for just the beauty and fashion niche and that's fine and maybe that's why I haven't been successful in those niches on social media um but i want to get into more relatable and more like useful information and more and share my parts of my life that i feel like is valuable for people like more on the like um investing and career journey um the wellness and health journey that i'm on and just like lifestyle like whatever i'm going through in my life and i want to call that series millennial glow up because I'm a millennial, I'm a young millennial, I'm 27, and I just feel like we put up a front on social media, like most millennials, that we know everything, we have everything figured out, we're so popular, and we have all this money and all this fame and all this, all these assets, but I just feel like it's all a lie and it's all false. Um, there are some people that are really blessed and they have um they have done amazing things and they have accomplished amazing things and they really are wealthy and they really do have amazing things and they are happy and everything but i feel like most of us aren't and a lot of that is really false so i want to get into my career and my investment journey the mistakes that i've made what i'm doing to get back on track um i still live with my parents at 27 and i know that 
there's pros and cons to it. I'm also from a Latin Dominican background where it's kind of like the norm for for children to stay in their parents' home if they're not married and definitely if they're not in a stable career and they still need like their parents' help. It's not like like the tra like traditional American way that you just turn 18 or get out of college and you move out into you know a shitty apartment with roommates even if you're struggling and even in those situations parents are still like funding their kids i just happen to be living with my parents and that's the decision that i've made and the life choices that have put me in this position i've also spent a lot of money on trips because i love traveling and in college i studied abroad and i realized that traveling was amazing and i love it but you know i want to earn those things and I want to and I want to feel like I'm not going into debt or backtracking my life for a trip anymore I want to be able to like have excess and have so much money saved or invested and the excess of that and if I'm able to bring in more income and that's like fun money then I can enjoy it and truly just keep seeing the world um buy things that make me happy after I have everything all saved off so I'm like learning as I go and I've made a lot of mistakes and I just want to make this millennial glow up series to show you guys that that what you're going through you aren't alone like there are so many people that don't have their careers all set by like 25 that they are still struggling with debt and money management and anxiety and mental health issues but I really just want to make this series based on just relatable like storytelling just sharing with you guys my personal experiences what the choices that I made that have led me down this road and also how I'm getting out of it and how I'm like moving on from like child and confused and insecurities and anxieties and like you know moving on to like more stability and independence and confidence and maturity and financial savviness and just everything so i hope you guys like the series and i want to keep it on my main channel because i don't want to just make one channel for um a certain niche and then run out of things to talk about run out of videos to make and then like it just die off i want to make this a part of my personal brand i want to include different aspects of my life and i want to include different topics and i want to you know just share different things but still relate it back to like me as a whole i just want to make it a whole series of how i'm glowing up how i'm moving on moving out of my parents house finding my career finding um the opportunities that are best for me um building confidence myself charging my worth selling myself believing in myself hyping be my own hype person and fantasizing about my own life instead of just looking at other people's life on instagram and youtube and even um fiction shows television. and i hope some people appreciate it and some people gain value from it